Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. We're going to talk about Engine Coin. A lot of people have asked, when should you invest in this? We're going to cover it now. So welcome to the channel. If you're new, subscribe, hit the bell button, like, comment, and tell your friends, right? Simple as that. Um, Engine Coin, it's been mentioned a lot, and again, as normal, in socials, in this comment section, whatever, if you want me to cover a coin in this format, when to invest, I have a playlist of all the ones I've done. So if you're like into certain coins, you know, and you want to know, is it a good time to invest or not? Educational sort of point of view. This is an educational video, by the way, in terms of what the coin is. Um, when is it safe to invest to mitigate some risk? And most importantly, the obvious question, the chat, right? To show you it in full, full glory, essentially. So engine coin has been on a bit of a run over the past what few months like most old coins in, in fairness and this is this is a good one right in terms of partnerships what it is fundamentals of all kinds of cool stuff right it's all right it's not the worst one you can buy there's some absolute shockers in and around the world of cryptocurrency that you should not touch and i quite often ignore when people ask me to do them sorry but Again, as I say, please do give suggestions if you think it's worth it. But if the coin is rubbish, I won't even entertain it because I don't see the point of it. Um, so first thing that came onto the website is trusted by millions. I really like this website. I think it's cool. I think the, the graphics are really neat and tidy. The wallet side of it, and I know people that personally use the wallet and they like it for ease. It's really, really good. One million plus, obviously, installations. <laughs> One billion assets created and obviously a decent volume. But in terms of all this, it's got some mega partners. It's got a mega decent platform. It's powered. It powers a lot of things. And there's all kinds of magical things happening with this. And it's definitely, if you are into the side of gaming and the tokenomics of marketplace transactions, this is probably the leading light. With this and FITA, the leading light. It's unbelievable. And... It's going to change, I think, the way mobilization of this, your device, how it works and how everything kind of matters as a currency. And that's the biggest thing with this currency. It's huge. So let's have a little look. Platform. When it loads. My internet's a bit slow, by the way. I do apologize. I'm currently in the process of changing things. It's a nightmare. Um, so evolve your game. This is how it all kind of works. Obviously, you can build assets on the blockchain. It's got all kinds of stuff. You can obviously market it, monetization, integration, and the ability to create your own utility. It's pretty solid, right? I do apologize for my slow internet. Ha, that's a cool little bot. So there's all kinds of things working for you on this. Now, you've obviously, there's so much out there in terms of products, but this is like the most realistic thing we've got in terms of a utility of real life use, where game developers and all kinds of project managers can use this to build blockchain games and apps. Pretty cool. Um, as I say, I apologize for my crappy internet. They also have a wallet, right? Simple as that. The wallet is very, very easy to use. It's very, very handy. I personally don't use it, but I know a lot of people that do use it. And with the fundamentals of a wallet, it has all the ingredients to be literally a perfect ERC20 wallet. Simple as that. And obviously, it has, can you see it? That Samsung word. They have a huge partnership with Samsung. Samsung is a massive, massive partnership um, for the engine wallet. And that really, really made it rocket to the moon. And that is a real big thing. Now, th the reason why it's got a partnership with Samsung they basically have it on their devices. So certain devices have this wallet already built in, which is absolutely amazing. So in terms of the look of it, it's decent. It works very, very well. It's very, very easy to kind of use and store. And it obviously, it gives you all the information that you need on this page. And in all fairness, I'm going to look at one more thing, which is obviously the marketplace for engine. And then we're going to start looking at the charts and other things to look at. But I mentioned this at the start of the video, the tokenization of assets and the use of money this is a great thing to do you can buy and sell little assets using the engine blockchain and obviously pretty huge like look at the volume on a, on, a, on a little marketplace using that token this will get bigger and bigger over time this is where things get interesting for the world of blockchain the use of you know currency 
it's it's quite obvious on these, isn't it? When you think about it, any medium of exchange is going to be like for life or something. Look look at when you are on the apps, when you are playing your little crappy games. When you, you, you're doing it, it's all in fiat. This is all in the blockchain world. This is totally different. So definitely looking at it as a punt. Now, obviously, do further research. It is its own blockchain. It is powered by certain things that are obviously different um, to other elements out there. And as you can see here, Microsoft um, Microsoft element, yeah. Some decent games. Absolutely decent games. And I've seen some of the games built on this exchange. Um, not exchange, sorry. On this platform. Absolutely mind-blowing, right? In terms of the, what it can deliver. So in terms of blockchain, in terms of adoption definitely worth looking at if you're into gaming if you're into the even trading little assets and cool stuff like that you remember when you were younger trading little baseball cards and bloody pokemon cards etc kind of cool so moving on though quick mention to crypto.com reason being they've got a listing event coming up this is a syndicate okay crypto.com link below by the way I've, I have the card. I don't have it on me. It's downstairs, but I have the Ruby card. Basically, if you stake a minimum amount of Crow token, you can get into the syndicate where you can win and get gifted some engine tokens. Definitely worth doing it, especially if you're holding the Crow token. Um, obviously, the Crow token is like ranked 11 right now in terms of coin market cap metrics. We're doing really, really well. The MCO token, if you stake that, you get a better reward on your card, 2% off on your card payments and stuff. But this, in terms of like everything that you need, as a company, really good, and they're doing a lot of syndicates at the minute. And Engine is one of them that's happening, obviously, in six days' time. Um, randomly email, so, oh, cool, that's a good thing to cover today. So, you can see here, by the way, just to let you know, this obviously, if there's too many people jump in, you won't get as much. Just be these are maximum allocations, not minimum. So, just bear that in mind, anyways. On to the chart, let's look at fundamental sort of side of it in terms of price data we've been doing well since the, the market crash we're doing incredibly well all coins have been doing incredibly well this will probably as it looks like it come down we've got a load of divergences on the rsi which is the main point of call but we're going to look at support and resistances and stuff like that and in terms of places where you can look at maybe loading up because it's done very very well over the past few months um, last year, I remember the Samsung partnership really rocketed it, and that was massively important for the altcoin market because a lot of things were doing good. Like a lot of altcoins were doing really well in terms of development. So like, oh, this is cool. Nothing happened. Price, no one was interested. Samsung, though, boom, bang. It's like, fuck, engines went flying. Huge, huge partnership, and really, really good for the industry. So massively massively important you understand the importance of a very good partnership certainly when samsung i have an iphone by the way just to let you know but imagine right you buying a phone right which is crazy right oh, buy a phone but when you look at it and you think there's a blockchain wallet there that is powered and designed by that token that currency that company what you're going to use first isn't it if you've never ever ever experienced bitcoin or cryptocurrencies ethereum whatever you're going to use that one wallet you're going to know instantly by the name oh cool engine it's a really really great market employee anyways first level the obvious level boom this one here now i will change the colors in a second this is weekly level. This is probably the most key level you're going to probably find in the central of the chat now i only have data up well, to about April 20, 2019. But that doesn't really bother me. Um, in terms of fundamentals, it's current price action we're looking for. So that is one key weekly level. The next weekly level we're looking at is obviously here, as it's obviously turned around there. You know, cool, cool, cool. And we're going to put one at the bottom as well, and the top. Simple as that, really. That's all we're going to do for the weeklies. Very, very obvious. These are like literally as you would. Now, I'm actually not going to put it at the top. I'm going to actually put it here. Why? Because look at this level here, that's the key, and it kind of makes it nice and simple and very, very easy to manage. Moving down though to the daily time frame, this is what we're looking at. We've got a bit more of a squidge. Now, the first thing I'm going to do first, I'm going to put a fib, but what I'm going to do as I'm going to do it body to body to see how it lines up. It lines up pretty damn good in fairness. Let's look, just check to see what it's like wick to wick. It depends. I get asked this question all the time. Wick to wick or body to body? 
As long as you're consistent, it doesn't really matter. Personally, both work. It doesn't matter, but we'll stick with wick to wick for this one. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at daily levels. Daily levels are massively important as well. And you've already seen here, we've retraced down to the 382. So probably, ideally, the, one of the places to buy would have been there. If we form a higher high, this video is pretty much invalidated. If we go beyond this level, that is. So let me just make sure that people can see that. So if we go beyond this level, that level there, all these Fibonacci levels will be ruined. In terms of the weekly levels and support and resistances, they'll be fine. They're, they can stay for the matter of time for eternity. It doesn't really matter. Anyways, moving on, let's do some daily levels because this is also vitally important. We've got a very, very key level here, which you've probably already noticed, where just beyond that Fib level. Simple as that. That is the most obvious one you're ever going to see. Why? Look at it. Perfect resistance throughout, even to the start of the year, and obviously support and support there again. So that is one level there. Very, very simple. The next one is just as obvious. You've probably already seen it on the screen. You can point at the screen if you want. It's entirely up to you. But here, <laughs> very, very obvious. Why is it obvious? you got resistance here in line pretty much with it, nearly in line with it. I'll move it down. There you go. You've then got support, resistance, back up, back up, and it went through it there. If I look left and put my cursor on it here, we've got more level here, more levels there, and you've probably got more in time. That is also the 618 level. It's massively important, that level, and it's probably a psychological level of the 11 cents region for this asset too. And finally, there's one more daily level that we want to plot on here. It's kind of the obvious one. Have you noticed it yet? I hope you have. There you go. Simples. Simple, simple, simples. So, you're probably wondering why that you need to do these. Well, in hindsight, it's massively important that you understand where support and resistances are on any given chart. Now, I'm going to put this near to the top levels where it's quite a lot of resistance there obviously failed um we are coming down the next place it'll probably go wouldn't surprise me if it goes up to here okay as a buy point but you've also got to think ema is there this is also lower time frame support and resistance if i go down to a lower time frame this here that's four hour intraday levels to keep an eye on that is a heavy support level from the past, which we've been tapped a few times, also a heavy resistance level. So keep that in mind as well. That is roughly around 19 cents. So psychologically, pretty damn decent. Um, in terms of everything else, what you should do, obviously checking out the Fibonacci levels as well, there's obviously levels down here. It's entirely up to you though, your mindset, your game. If we are gonna bounce, and it's going to be a long-term trade, you could probably look at potential targets of up to 30 cents and 36 cents. If this is going to go and basically do this, if it's going to go down, retrace to this level, and it forms a higher high from that liquidity tap and back up, that is definitely an option. But if you're looking to just invest and you're finding a good place to find it, and you've, you've done your research, you're like, oh, engine coin, Decent, very, very decent. I'm wanting this piece of cake. Well, you've got to look at roughly 11 cents at least. At least, if you're going to get optimum risk reward. Top tip though, buy a little bit here, buy a little bit here, buy a little bit here. Simple as that. So you've got 15.8 cents, 13.4 cents, and 11 cents. Seven cents down in these levels. But again, like all my videos, this is not financial advice. You should be able to be in a, in a mindset where you should be looking for the cheaper and better opportunities for you to purchase these assets, essentially. Best cost dollar average, cool. Best risk reward, cool. As I say, though, this Fibonacci level will be totally invalidated if it goes beyond this level. However, wick to wick looks pretty good. Nice, neat and tidy. They're on the right points. And there you go. Hope you enjoy this video anyways. If you like it and you want to, obviously, me to cover any of your coins that you want me to look at, Drop a comment. Please